right, so we got a new one from Oasis. My girlfriend saw it, thought it was intriguing. This is one that she can enjoy and I can enjoy. So it's a kettle sour, which is another version of um, just sour beers. Uh, you control the yeast, but it's still wild. And then you get, you get going and uh, you do all the same techniques as regular beer and you get a slight sourness to it. So uh, trying this one, I already got a, a one to get the profile going, see what direction it goes. But the main focus is it has honey, bell, tangelo, oranges, which come from the Rio Grande area of Texas. It's a uh, very mandarin, grapefruit, and tangerine flavors. So what I'm gonna do on the video on here, I'll describe what I have and let's see. So anyone that's not into hops or not really into beer like that, this is more where it's casual, slightly sour like um, a goza, and it has a little bit of salt. So the SRM on this, uh, it refers to the color of the actual beer itself. This is a little cloudy. So Oasis is near a lake, beautiful area, beautiful place to visit. And we're looking at uh, 4.3 ABV, uh, 10 IBUs and the SRM is six. So the color scale refers to how dark it is. It starts to get to gold. This is still probably like a hazy lager looking type of beer, but it has a slight orange tangerine salty sea salt peel kind of smell and that's what it is it's very refreshing lightly salty lightly sour so anyone that's never had sours this would be the time to really enjoy it uh, this is by oasis it's called technicolor motorhome so if you see this and you want to try a goza or sour concept this is the one to go with it's very low um, not super intense, so this is like a good intro. Then uh, Zilker has one uh, called uh, something magic, spontaneous magic or something like that. That one's a good one. And uh, once you go to like Blue Owl, Blue Owl's really good, but they have more uh, sourness from the kettle souring. So that's when you start to upgrade a little bit and see if that's what you really like. And honestly, it's hit or miss. Some people love it, some people hate it, some people are like indifferent. I have some I like and some I don't like. And these are pretty mellow. I can enjoy quite a bit of acidity. Acidity is found in all your citrus. Tomatoes have acidity. Vinegar has acidity. So all those things are pretty much hand in hand and it's good to have with food. It keeps it vibrant and lively. So hopefully this is a video that can help you understand if you're gonna try sour, if you wanna do a sour, or if you're just gonna stay away from it. So other than that, uh, do be safe, enjoy your holidays, and just have fun, enjoy your beer. Prost.